What's up you guys? I am Osino Koko Wakuslengane. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, we welcome you. Join the family, hit subscribe and hit that notification button. And hopefully the relationship will grow from there and blossom into something beautiful. Again, Happy New Year you guys. And I hope that this year is going amazing for everyone so far. And hopefully we've all made our New Year's resolutions because I feel like we can add a few things to those resolutions you know it's just good habits to take into the year or resolution ideas and all those good things you know so i'm just going to start with the first one i feel like this year we definitely need to focus on our spiritual well-being okay and i feel like spiritual well-being goes along with mental health it goes along with emotional health you know and like like just spiritual health like in every sphere you guys okay we need to take care of our spirit before we can take care of our mind before we can take care of other people and everything else which again i did mention this in my eight lessons from 2018 video um this year we need to focus on spiritual well-being and spiritual growth and just all things related to that you know so that is the first new year's resolution idea you can bring into 2019 another one is the career okay we need to be focused you guys this year we need to do more than just saying let's secure the bag we actually need to secure the bag okay like ugh, guys i can't press like i get so pressed because like i don't like asking for things so i get so pressed like when i see people who who are like chilling and like so comfortable in not achieving their best whereas in, you know that like, this person has so much more to offer not because you think that you're better than but because like you've actually seen this person doing better and that they can a actually do that again you know so and i also just think that in order for these things to actually even be a thing you need to be better organized which is my third point so organization you guys is so important because like if that is out of play, then honey, trying anything after that is going to be an absolute joke, okay? I feel like it's so important that we get ourselves organized, get ourselves organized um, mentally, literally, okay? Like, if you guys can see here behind me, I'm trying some sort of organization, you know, trying to pack things away, clean up your space around you okay start with little things maybe just clean out okay i will not say the the kitchen first because honey the kitchen can take a long time start with your room before you go to like the like rest of like the house okay start with your room because i feel like most people it's your final place of like calming down and just unwinding so you need that space to be calming and just allowing for better and like like better final thought processes you know so definitely organize yourself declutter and gradually go throughout your your house or your space or your apartment or wherever it is that you do live okay and the next point is gratitude okay i feel like we need to be more thankful this year like more thankful of like everything you know like the little things because also we need to remember that we need to be so thankful for other people and, and like the like simple things that like they like do for us because guys like no one owes you anything in this life okay if you want something you, you actually like just need to get it for yourself so if someone does something for you and they did not even have to you had better make sure that you you say thank you to that person because listen People don't need to do nice things for us, okay? People don't need to serve you things on a silver platter. They honestly really just don't have to. So, gratitude for little things. Gratitude, and not just to others. Thank yourself. Congratulate yourself when you, when you, when you do good, you know? Positive affirmations are another one. I think that's number five or six. I don't even know. But positive affirmations and positive thoughts and... Being positive in general is so important because that somehow pr 
programs our like thought processes to 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 being like a certain way and you immediately start to like project that positivity to the spaces around you and uh, um the people that are around you and like near you you know and yeah so which then goes to my next point which is to be more kind okay guys ugh, kindness is just so important because like everyone is going through things and all of us need to be considerate of one another and what the like next person could be going through you know i feel like it's so important that we actually just be kind to people because we actually all need each other in this world okay even that person on the street that you think that you don't need who knows your blessing might just lie in 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 you doing something so small and what you feel is minuscule for them you know but above all else like can we not think that we are doing things for the people but i sometimes do things for myself like i i i am kinder to people for for my own sake because i feel like once you've done something good it 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 makes you feel nice inside you know versus if if like you've been rude or whatever i mean like if being mean to people makes you feel good then honey something is wrong with you but anyway yeah so all those things pretty much lead to better relationships which is something else that we need to cherish in 2019 you guys we need 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 good relationships we need good financial relationships good um academic relationships for like students and anyone else who is actually studying we need better um career related relationships we need better family relationships we need better um friendships i can't really speak much on romantic relationships because i i, I can't relate but if you're in a relationship or you're married or engaged or whatever then give it time allow yourself to actually be present in that relationship stop flaking on people and this just goes beyond like a romantic relationship but like any sort of like relationship like with your colleagues and you know all these things will immediately work better as soon as you start being better at in 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 being positive to yourself and being positive with others and showing gratitude to others and all these like smaller things you know so it's very important in 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 my mind that we form these relationships and that we are better at that you know now another point that is not related to any of these is take care of yourself okay but taking care of yourself in terms of health i mean mental health is key okay mental health is so important guys i feel like i don't know i feel like mental health is like one of, one of the things i am so focused on because i know personally like what it's like to be depressed what it's like to be anxious and just unhappy for like no reason and oh, it's such a crappy place to be in you know like i honestly feel like mental health is so important um on top of that like we also need to prioritize uh physical health okay this year as every other year i'm getting into like a healthier r regime my body is trash it's fine we we are dealing with that and it's metabolism with like yeah never mind moving on <laughs> anyway um take care of yourselves physically guys you only have one body and one body only and take care of that body you know and taking care of your body or being healthy does not mean we are all gonna be skinny it does not mean we are all gonna look like about tara things because this is one tara things you know like there's this girl guys she's stunning if i if i'm not mistaken guys yeah like those kids are beautiful now but also we need to be comfortable with ourselves we're not gonna be like them we're not gonna be as thin as they are we're not gonna be or have those body types you know because if you look at sakisani and you look at mithali and you look at tuli pongolo pretty much the same body type it doesn't mean song is um guys and that is okay okay and then another thing is um beyond just working out like physically you also need to eat right okay 
we can't still be here with Spatlo, we can't be here with Maguinya, Nalifet, um, Nalimin Smith, you know, we can't be doing that on a constant. Now, am I saying you must stop? No, because that food tastes like heaven, okay? Don't play yourself. If you crave chocolate, have it, okay? But don't eat the whole slab now, okay? You break, you load three pieces, and you go chill, and you sip, okay? And have your cheat days. <laughs> Heck, if you need a whole day to cheat, then do it. If you need just one meal, then do that, you know? Whatever works for you, do that, you know? And, yeah, um... That's about all I can say that we need to like take into 2019 and yeah, value yourself, value others, be respectful, be kind, show gratitude, okay, love your body, love your mind, love, you, love your emotions, okay, love those around you, put God first, what else am I missing, value your career, build an empire, honey. Okay, I have been shook since Petrus Mutsipid and um, donated, what, like, a quarter of a million dollars. So, which is like 3.4 something billion. Honey, I, I have been shook, okay? A part of me, a part of my spirit was shaking. Like, this man didn't donate 3.4 billion rands. And now you're going to like 0. 0.4. Like do, you, like, do you understand about 0. 0.4 is 400 and something million. And I'm just like. So. That had me shaken. You also had better be shaken. Get your life together. Let's get this coin. And focus on yourself, guys. Oh, and to the varsity students, the high school students, primary students. Guys, value academia. Because, yay, good half out here. Okay, good half funders. Do school right, bruh. Get those B's and those distinctions now that you can. Don't be like, oh, I'm just doing high school just to pass. Or I'm just doing varsity just to pass. If your undergrad marks are very subpar, postgrad is going to be very difficult for you to get into. Okay. Also, study what you love, bruh. Like, don't. Like, because I, I, I can't pressurize that enough. Study what you love, what you know you are actually going to find a career in and not just something that is a current fad or a current, like, phase or whatever or something you love but you don't see a future in. Do research into the career that you want. Therefore, you will know what studies to actually take. Okay? Don't assume. Anyway. I love you guys so much. From my heart to yours, nothing but love and light and the word and the love of God. Over, 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 over